man has been sentenced to eight years in prison in Mississippi for possessing cannabis he says he legally obtained in Oregon, but outraged activists say he received the harsh sentence on account of his race. Patrick Beadle, 46, a musician who was born in Jamaica and resides in Oregon, was sentenced to eight years in prison without parole on Monday for drug trafficking. He originally faced a max sentence of 40 years in prison after he was found with two 89 pounds of marijuana concealed in his vehicle on March 7, 2017, as he was driving through Madison County, Mississippi. He was convicted by a jury in July, however prosecutors admitted that there no evidence to prove that Beadle was trafficking drugs, according to the Clarion Ledger. Beadle did not possess a large sum of money, drug paraphernalia, or a scale. Cops only found the nearly three pounds of marijuana in his vehicle. Beadle said purchased the marijuana legally in Oregon, where the recreational use of weed was approved in 2014, and the medicinal marijuana was legalized in 1998. He purchased the cannabis using a medical marijuana card to treat the chronic pain he suffers in both of his knees from playing college basketball. However, taking cannabis across state lines is illegal, and in Mississippi recreational and medical marijuana is illegal as well. He was stopped by police for crossing a fog line in the road as he was on a road trip to pay homage to blues singer B. B. King in his home state. But Beatle believes he was a victim of racial profiling, targeted for his dreadlocks and license plate from another state. Once stopped cops discovered the marijuana stash. With an ounce of medical marijuana costing around $50 to $100, Beatle may have spent between $2,300 to $4,600 on the load of cannabis. In court Beatles' mother Tommy Beatle pleaded with judges to not send her son to prison. Share this article share judge, I'm asking for mercy for my son. I wouldn't stand here before you if my son was trafficking in drugs. As a mother, I'm asking you to please don't lock him up behind bars, she said. Madison County Circuit Judge William Chapman said he will not reduce Beatles' charge to simple possession because he was already convicted under the state's drug trafficking law. He added that Beatle will have to serve the entire eight-year sentence since Mississippi does not permit parole or probation, according to The Hill. Beatles' attorney Cynthia Stewart says his sentence will be appealed. She noted that given the U. S is quickly changing marijuana laws, in five years, this may not even be a crime. The American Civil Liberties Union says that Beatle was stopped and given a long prison sentence on account of his skin color, calling his sentence inexcusable. He was stopped for a traffic violation by a police department we have sued for racial bias, the organization tweeted on Wednesday. The ACLU filed a lawsuit Mississippi Police Department in Madison County for racial bias following Beatles' case in 2017 claiming that black people are targeted aggressively by police, according to the Washington Post.